Assalamualaikum. Welcome to Farm and Form. And today we will discuss one of the most important and practically observed defect of the tablet manufacturing, which is known as overwetting. In this video, we will discuss what is the overwetting, why overwetting occur, how we can prevent the overwetting, and what are the drawbacks of the overwetting. So let's start our video. And if you have not subscribed my channel, first of all, press the subscribe button. and also visit my website farmandform.com to read more interesting article so what is the overwetting overwetting is the condition where our powder materials become more wet or a duffy mass is produced during the kneading stage of the wet granulation if you are not familiar with various stages of the wet granulation the link of playlist of wet granulation steps and stages is provided in the description must watch the complete video so in simple words overwetting is the defect where large lumps or duffy mass is produced during the kneading stage of wet granulation in the rapid mixing granulator or in the plow mixer or in the spiral mixer so why overwetting defect occur what are the reasons of overwetting there are two most common possible reasons of the overwetting one is the more solvent mean if we add more solvent to the powders for the wetting purpose it will result in the overwetting or large lumps production or in the production of duffy mass the next reason is the increased kneading time mean if we add the solvent in appropriate quantity but increase the mixing time after addition of solvent this will also result in the formation of large lumps or duffy mass one most important point is that overwetting is usually observed during the manufacturing of first batch of the new product because we have no historical data for the usage of solvent for the large scale manufacturing of the batch and it may also occur due to the manufacturer or source change of the api or excipient because the solvent quantity may also vary due to the change of the manufacturer of the api or excipient so we should critically observe the quantity of solvent added in the validation batches and second most important point is that when validation is completed and we adjust the quantity of solvent and we adjust the kneading time then why overwetting occur the answer is that after validation batches the answer is that after validation batches if overwetting occur it is due to the negligence of the operator or the qualified person because they do not critically measure the quantity of solvent or they do not critically follow the kneading time next is how to prevent overwetting to prevent the overwetting defect always use the optimum quantity of the solvent and add more solvent after physically observing the condition of powder material in the rapid mixing granulator or in the plow mixer or in the ribbon mixer and next one is the kneading time always adjust the kneading time by physically observing the condition of powder materials in the rapid mixing granulator or ribbon mixer or in the plow mixer the next one is that what are the drawbacks of overwetting mean if our batch is overwet what will happen next the drawbacks of overwetting are difficult to pass through the wet mill mean when our powder material will be overwet or they will be duffy they will not easily pass through the wet mill and wet mill choking will be observed next when we will go towards the drying of this batch into fluidized bed dryer the proper fluidization will not be achieved and next one is that after drying the overwet mass results in the production of hard granules and these hard granules are very difficult to pass through the sieve during the sieving of dried mass and it also result in the sieve breakage or sieve damage the next defects are related to the disintegration time and dissolution profile mean hard granules disintegration time is prolonged and we are familiar that if disintegration time is prolonged the dissolution profile is low the next one is that all these drawbacks results in the loss of our productivity and results in increase the operational cost so always try to prevent the overwetting by carefully observing the 
needing stage or wetting step of the wet granulation if you have any confusion do mention in the comment box and if you like the video share it to others and do subscribe my channel till the next video allah hafiz